Hi, this is a haunted mirror that I made for this year's Halloween party. And the idea is that when one of the party goers stands in front of the mirror, it's going to show them a scary image. And when I step away from the mirror, it's going to turn back into a normal mirror until the next person steps in front of it. So behind the mirror is a proximity sensor. That's what's telling us that someone's in front of the mirror. And also behind the mirror is one of these guys, which is a 32 by 32 RGB LED matrix. And the way we're controlling it is via the open source yo-yo board, which is this guy here. And the creator of the yo-yo board happens to live next to me, which is very convenient for me. Uh, his name's Itai. And he was nice enough to write a special firmware for this guy to interface with this guy. And that's what's pretty cool about it, is it's all being controlled from this Android phone. So in addition to static images, it can also do animations. So I just downloaded a few animations. These are in animated GIF format, so you can just download, download those from the internet. I'll just pick a couple here so you get the idea. And um, of course you can also author your own animations. Um, the resolution is 32 by 32, so fairly low res, but you can do some pretty cool stuff. Um, here's one I did with some, some fish, so it's kind of an aquarium kind of deal. And then here's another one I did that has some iconic um, video game images from the 80s. And so for this one, I'm going to go into exactly that same app and I'm going to go into settings. And from settings, I'm going to click the red rum box. Red rum is murder, spelled backwards, from the movie The Shining. And I want to show that uh, this time when I step in front of the mirror. Now, because I spent so much time on this project, my wife is actually a little upset at me right now. So I wrote this app called the Complementary Mirror. And the idea is that when my wife walks up to the mirror, it's going to automatically give her a compliment. Uh, so you see it there, when I step away from the mirror, it's going to turn back into a normal mirror. And let me do it again. That is the complimenting mirror. So here's another app, and this one just takes advantage of the touch screen. So I can draw whatever I want uh, on there. So I can write some text. And uh, let's say oh, maybe I want to clear that, and I want to change the color to, let's say, purple. And I can just draw whatever I want, and it's going to show up on the mirror. I drew the snake, and it's going to show up on that mirror. And the cool thing is that um, it will save it. So even though I turn my phone off, um, it will be saved. So I don't need to tie up my phone. If, say you want to leave a message for someone or something like that, phone is turned off, but the image stays uh, on the mirror when the phone is gone. Here's the last app. It's a slideshow app. And you just swipe to start the slideshow, and it's just going to cycle through the images. And of course, you can control how long each Im image stays from the settings of the app. And the other thing is that all the images are being loaded from your SD card or your internal memory. So if you want to customize it, you know, of course, add your own images. Very easy to do so. You don't have to do any coding. Just copy them to the SD card in a certain folder, and the app will pick it up automatically. Then if you want to uh, stop the slideshow, just swipe again. That'll stop it. And then you can see here I've got quite a few images to choose from. You can just pick any image you want. Uh, let me just pick one. And then just like the other apps, it'll save the last image. So if I turn off my phone, the image is still saved. They don't tie up my phone. So uh, that's pretty much it. Thanks for checking out the project.